I always think back to when I was a kid living in New York City, Laurelton, Queens, and um, I'd be in the basement all the time and my mother and father would be upstairs. And whenever I would blast Michael Jackson's music, everyone knew not to come downstairs. They gave me my time alone, sometimes for hours. And I would play Billie Jean, the Motown 25 version, over and over again. And I never hid that I was a Michael Jackson fan, even when he went through his tough times. I always showed it out loud I was a fan. I would dance in the street, didn't care who was around. I'd sing out loud in front of anybody. If they had a t-shirt that said, I hate Michael Jackson, <laughs> I'd make them love Michael Jackson, because I loved Michael Jackson. I wasn't trying to be Michael. I wasn't trying to copy him, but I really admired the way he danced and he sang. So I just did it all the time because it made me feel good. And it actually kept me in shape. So that's what I did. And as I got older, I started performing in a nightclub. And I made a lot of friends. And when I met my girlfriend, she knew who Michael Jackson was but never heard his music. And uh, together, for me being a Michael fan, she became a huge Michael fan. And we did the movie Soldier of the Arts. When Michael passed, I was so sad, I was so heartbroken, I was so upset. I remember crying so hard in front of the Apollo. And I was by myself, but I made a lot of friends out there and it was really beautiful. I released the movie Soldier of the Arts December 25th. And it was 2012 and it got about, I expected about 135 hits in six months. It's an hour long movie. I got 1600 hits and almost a thousand hits in almost the first week. So June 25th, I would like everybody to come and just watch it with me one time and celebrate the way I celebrate Michael Jackson by dancing to his music, putting a little story to it, and enjoying the life and times of one of the greatest entertainers of all time who I had the pleasure to meet and also had the pleasure to see in concert twice. Thanks, everybody, and enjoy. June 25th, Soldier of the Arts.